What's up, guys? Welcome to another episode of the Bank Buster series. So, today we're going to be looking at people's banks, same as last time. There's no particular accounts we're looking at. We're just going to kind of look at a bunch of random people. Once there's more people playing, and once I, ha once I have a better idea of what accounts here, what accounts, I'll start doing, like, Iron Man-only episodes, Hardcore-only episodes, Ultimate-only episodes, Donator-only episodes, etc. Stuff like that. Uh, but for now, we'll just jump right into it. So, the first person we're going to take a look at... We're looking at Joe Rays. So he is not online at the moment, so we had to log into his account. The first things we noticed is he died. <laughs> Looks like he was probably doing Vorkath. Yeah, that's crumbling dead, right? Yep. Looks like he was doing Vorkath, and if we look in here, he has anti-shield, so. Uh, yeah, Vorkath is tough, so I, I could see it. So he should have a ton of stuff. I definitely expect him to have a really nice bank. Dragon on a crossbow? Nice. I wonder if he bought this, or if he got it in a raid. I know he was raiding with the team, uh, but... I also know that somebody else got a Dragon Hunter crossbow, so if I had to guess, they probably sold it to him. Nice gear. Let's take a look at his bank. It's a nice cash stack. We can already see. Like, I, I picked him for a reason. You can see why, right? He's got a, a nice chunk of stuff. Oh, he's got third age, including the amulet. I think the Beads of the Dead are, are like way better than the amulet. The Beads of the Dead are too good. They need to be nerfed, but <laughs> we'll talk about that later. Anyway, so he's got stew. Nice. And Beauty Eyes got those anti-venom. Uh... Only six. Yeah, we need to we need to fix anti venom so people can get more of those. Got the entire ring set. That's cool. That's cool. Serpelm, nice. The shields. I like his bank really well organized. It looks nice. I told them like two weeks ago I was gonna do him in a video, or I asked him if I could do him in a video, and uh, he said yeah. So he's probably been expecting this for a long time. He's had plenty of time to organize his bank. Barrows tab. I'm assuming he's actually working on barrows. I don't know. Uh, just herb lore secondary and stuff like that. Sanfu serums, if, if you didn't know, they actually cure poison. They cure poison and they restore prayer. And restore stats. So, I mean, they... I don't know, you didn't use them yet? I don't know if you're just saving them for something specific, but, you know, they, you know, I don't know. They have some uses, so make sure you use them. Really well organized food tab. Got the, the, the random uncut rubies in here. I wonder if that's because of, like, bird nests or something. No, because wouldn't they give the... They'd just give a ring, right? No, they wouldn't give the gym. I'm not sure why that's there. That should be somewhere else. But <laughs> I don't know. You do you. Nice. He's got an Infernal Pickaxe. That's pretty cool. Woodcutting tab. Uh, invention tab. Uh, cosmetics, I suppose. Rare rare stuff that he's not really trying to do anything with. That's cool. It's a little bit of currency, too. Kind of like a, a junk tab, but not like... Not like total junk stuff that I might use eventually. I don't know. This should go on the invention tab. But I guess if you're... I don't know. Feels like some random items are just not quite organized yet. Maybe maybe still in that process. Uh, this feels like... this. See, this seems like a junk tab or maybe like a loot tab. You just put all the loot you don't care about. Seems like his runes aren't organized. That's pretty interesting. Are they... No, so I guess he just randomly grabs runes as he needs them. I don't know. Uh, pay dirt? What are, you, what are you doing with pay dirt? Turn that in. Uh, alright. Alright, cool. And then stats. We already saw that he was maxed. Uh, I think it's too, it's really too early to, like, check people's collection logs. Once we start doing these more in the future, uh, let's, let's see Vorkat. Did he get anything of Vorkat? No. 16 kills, though. What about Zora? Oh, yeah, he got the Sir Pelham himself. 36 kills. Can we see, uh, oh, raids, yeah, raids. Can we see if he got the, the okay, so then he didn't. He, uh, somebody else got it and he bought it. I was just wondering. That's cool. Uh, probably not worth it to look at anything else. So the next person we're gonna look at is right over here. It's here long. So let's take a look. He is online, so we'll do a nice and powerful check bank. I just probably should have typed his name. That would have, uh, that would have made more sense. Well, let's take a look. All right, so potions. I remember we, when we check their banks we can't see their tabs, but we can just ass I'm just going to assume they have tabs. Most people nowadays use tabs. I know back in the day there used to be people, people like that had banks like this where they didn't. But uh, yeah, I don't know. It's considered barbaric nowadays. I know eventually someone's going to do it on purpose. I'm going to log into their account and I'm going to see it and I'm going to laugh. But alright, let's get started. we got potions at the top. This looks like some sort of events or event section, yeah. Got a lot of Sierra Brews, nice bandos, Cirque Rings, wow, full bandos, cool. Uh, two rape, wow, two rapiers, nice. If you disassemble it, it's a bunch of components. I don't know if you just want to save it for later, who knows, who knows, maybe it'll have a use in the future. 
Uh, we got uh, Titans, of course. Don't know if he's maxed. Oh, he's not maxed because we can. Yeah, we can. He doesn't have 126 combat, so. Sure, he's working on it. Runes. Nice chunk of wrath from the event. War Blessing. That's cool. 30 inch Kai Shield. It's nice. It seems like an invention section right here. Makes sense with the clue stuff, too, for lucky components. This all looks like stuff that you can't quite disassemble yet. Yeah, a lot of elegant. We need to add that to the list. Bob shirts, yeah. I need to just look at people's banks and I'll find a good chunk of what needs to be assembled. So I'm, I'm glad people are keeping it. Some people just drop it all. I understand if you're an ultimate Iron Man, but like if you can put it in your bank, I don't know. We're going to get to it eventually. Of course we will. Uh, some more. This looks like some raid stuff. Dark Relic, nice. It doesn't function at the moment, but it, it will. I'm just I'm undecided if I want to make it work like old school where it gives you experience. Um, there's there's just one reason for it, and it's a dumb reason. If you currently use the lamp, that there's no way to get in the game. The invention icon's off. That's that's literally the only reason I don't want to add it yet. Once I once I can fix that, it'll probably be in game at some point. Let's keep going. Uh, just yeah, it's starting to get junkish. A lot of this stuff is like from uh, implings. You got uh, harpoons, some solar scales. Got some resource packs from the wilderness. Does have a cannon? Nice. Bunch of cannonballs too. Cool. Oh, nice bank. What's this cash stack for the email? Yeah, it's kind of hard to have a nice cash stack, but I guess it makes sense that uh, that Joe already has that big cash stack since he has 99 Invention, because 99 Invention is usually what burns through your cash stack. All right, next place we're taking a look at is Extinct, who is also online, so we will have to look at his. Uh, Extinct. Why can I not? Uh, okay, good. I did spell it right. All right, so he's max. We can see that right off the start. Nice. Scaling tabs right off the start. Outfits got some ram. I wonder if these are just, yeah, these seem like the ones that have scaling perks. Some invention stuff, herb lore farming, all pretty standard, pretty straightforward. Now we're getting some nice stuff. Bandos, that's pretty cool. Crossbow, nice. BGS, Serpome. It's got all the new shields. They're not really rare, so it's not that surprising. Bunch of crystal keys, too. Definitely doing a lot of the event. It's a lot of stuff from Zora, I think, I'm pretty sure. Bunch of clues, bunch of clues, waiting for magic pearl shit. Oh, he's got some magic oysters. I wonder if he's just, uh, I don't know, saving them for later. Not, wow, he's pretty concise bank. Not a lot of items. 329, is that accurate? Wow. Well, doesn't keep a whole lot of junk. I mean, he keeps some stuff that you might not need, but I don't know. Just for considering he's a max player, I, I figured there'd be more things, more junk. <laughs> So far, he seems to be doing a good job at that, though. Saren, Halo, Elden Sigma. It's cool. I can't remember what this is supposed to do. I assume they got it from... It's from Thieving. You get it from Thieving the uh, the elves at home. But I don't remember what it does, if anything. I don't know. But <laughs> nice that he had... I think, was it Joe that had it earlier? I, I don't know. Nice, buddy. Okay, so the next person we're taking a look at is Steven. Steven is a hardcore Iron Man. He's not online, so we did have to take a look at the account. Oh, I didn't know. He was kind of a skiller. I don't really know. <laughs> I'm assuming these were an accident with, like, with with auto retaliate on. You can reset your stats uh, with Mac at home if you wanted to. I'm not sure. I don't, yeah, I don't really know what the, I don't really know what happened here. I don't know. Maybe you thought about becoming a, a, a like, a normal account and then, I don't know, change your mind the last second. But, all right, so a lot of, a lot of skills. 99 uh, fishing. Seems like he's working on 99 cooking right now. Then the 99 woodcutting as well. Let's take a look at the bank. Okay, so we got the first tab. Yeah, so he's got, uh, oh, he's got a nice B ring. That's cool. I wonder if he got that from one of his, like, achievement boxes or something. Pyromancer garb. Did a little bit of winter tot. Some mulch pearls. Looks like it was probably just from that achievement. Laren's keys. Probably from that achievement again. This definitely seems like he's, was that why he did combat maybe? I don't know. Oh, third age play legs. That's pretty cool. I do have nice prayer bonus, so that's actually a really good item to pair with Torso for the future if you actually do train combat. Some nice gilded stuff too. Not bad. Go 2H. Tons of clues. I, I assume from... Oh, you know what? I wonder if he wanted to hit a certain level threshold to get clues from fishing. I don't know if that's... A, so if you didn't know, fishing is one of the very few skills that actually, like, you can only get certain clues based on your fishing level. So if you're, let's say you're 95 fishing, you will only get elite clues. You'll never get hard clues or easier mediums from fishing. So he would only get hard clues at his com or not his combat level. I'm dumb retarded. It's fishing level that matters. I don't know. I'm, I'm so stupid. Ignore me. 
I somehow got confused thinking the combat level mattered, but it doesn't. It's it's literally it's just your fishing level. So he just happened to get a bunch of hard clues on his way. Ignore me, I'm retarded. Uh, nice bank though with like this clue tab. He's got a really nice clue tab. Fury ornament. This is like one or tab, skill and tab and all that. Little, I mean, it's it's like he's 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 in a relatively new, hasn't played a whole lot. What's his playtime? Uh, two days, but it's, it's kind of really kind of hard to get accurate playtime because you can just AFK forever, and a lot of people do. Nice magic logs, yeah. Nice, nice account. Got a nice start to it. I have no clue what his plans are with these combat stats. Alrighty, so the last person I'm going to do for this video is somebody we actually did in the first episode, but there's kind of a reason why I want to take a look at his bank again. We're going to be looking at Gilded Iron, and a big part of it is the fact that he is one of the big raiders on the server. He, he is usually one of the people raiding him, Optic, Bank, and a couple other people. And he managed to get a twisted bow recently, so figured we'll take a look at his bank. We'll take a, you know, we'll take we'll see what what's improved. Uh, so I think I'm pretty sure we did him in the last episode, but yeah, let's let's take another look. So right, looking at his, I mean, it looks like he has a lot of good stuff on him already. So uh, nice anguish, and then of course the Tebow. Let's see what else he has hiding. Obviously, he's maxed from the max cape. And let's take a look. So runes at the top. Some Wrath Talismans, Wrath Runes, Sarah Halo, of course. Skill and stuff. Herb, uh, unfinished potions, nice, a lot of those. And then, yeah, more Herbler stuff. Clues, it's looking like. Samurai shirt. Samurai looks cool. I probably shouldn't have kept it in clues. Because now we can't use it for anything else. <laughs> yeah, what are you going to do? Now it's just cosmetic. Some farming stuff more. Smithing, invention. Now we're looking to the gear. Din's Bulwark, Bandos, Ancestral. Yeah, did, did quite a... Where's his uh, scrolls? Are these them? No, those are bonus XP scrolls. Where his... Like, I thought he had a bunch of... Uh, there's some Torn, but I thought he had more um, of the other ones. Because maybe it's maybe it's somebody... Maybe it's one of the other raiders I'm thinking of. One of, the, one of the raiders has a bunch of prayer scrolls that they're trying to occasionally trade for things. Like bonds and stuff like that. I was just curious if that was him. Doesn't seem like it. Cannon, of course, got the event stuff towards the bottoms, doing some Hydra stuff, uh, also doing some Molten Eels, that's cool, it's fun. Of course, he's got the Relics and the Torn Prayer Scrolls, Greeley's doing reads. Ooh, Hit Points Master, that's cool. Nice bank, nice bank. Oh, Dragon Hunter Lance, nice. Definitely a lot better than the last time. I think most of what is, like, impressive is what he's rocking himself. He's got, uh, what are those, the Guardian Boots? Is that what they're called? That's cool. Anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any ideas or suggestions for future episodes, let me know.